Hi everyone, this is Emmy. Today I'm going to show you how to knit this cute little gnome ornament. So let's get started. To make this little gnome, you can use either one strand of Red Heart Chunky Yarn or two strands of Worsted Weight Yarn. I'm working with Red Heart Chunky Yarn and 6mm knitting needles. I'm going to make the body section first. So cast on 12 stitches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, and 12. I'm going to work in stockinette stitch, so that means knit one row, purl one row. So I'm going to begin by knit one row. knit all the way across the row. Okay, I knit all the way across the row. For the next row, I'm going to purl across the row. So insert the needle into the stitch and purl. Purl all the way across the row. Okay, I purled all the way across the row. Now the next row, I will knit across the row. So knit every stitch all the way across the row. All the way across the row. And I have one here that's already finished and I worked 12 rows and then I cast off. To cast off, knit the first stitch Knit the next stitch, pull the previous stitch over and off the needle. Knit the next stitch, pull the previous stitch over and off the needle. And you work all the way across the row, and there's my cast off. So work 12 rows of stockinette stitch. And this is the hat. So the hat is worked in the same way as the body. And I have worked 8 rows of stockinette stitch and then I started to decrease. To knit the hat I cast on 16 stitches. Okay, for the hat I worked 8 rows. And then you have to begin to decrease on both sides for the top of the hat. To decrease, knit two stitches together, knit two stitches together. Now these last four stitches will be knit together, so I'm going to knit eight stitches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, knit two stitches together, and knit the remaining two stitches together, like that, purl across the next row. Purl all the way across the row. Okay, I purled all the way across the row. Now I'm going to repeat that again. Knit two stitches together. Knit two stitches together. These last four will be knit off, so knit the next four stitches. One, two, three, four. Knit two stitches together, 
knit the final two stitches together. So you can see I'm reducing down both sides, purl across the next row. I have eight stitches left. Knit two stitches together. Knit two stitches together. Knit two stitches together. And knit the last two stitches together. Four stitches. Purl across the row. I have four stitches. I'm going to knit two stitches together and knit the remaining two stitches together. And now I'll purl the remaining two stitches together and then fasten off and pull the yarn through that loop. And that's what the finished hat will look like. Okay, to assemble the body, I'm going to fold the work in half and I threaded the yarn end into a needle and I'm going to sew down the side and across the bottom. Now I'm going to weave through the bottom Now pull together that and close it Take one stitch to lock it in and pull the yarn end inside like that. And you can either use some fiberfill stuffing or some cotton balls. For the hat, I threaded the yarn into a needle. I'm just going to fold that little tip down like that and sew the seam. Like that. And I'm going to stuff the hat. I'm going to place the body inside. I'm just going to sew across the back for now, just to hold it on. Like that. To make the beard, I'm going to wind yarn around three fingers. Cut another length. Now slide this off. And tie this into a bundle. Cut open the loops and just trim it. And that's going to fit under the hat, like that. So now I'll just continue to sew the hat on. And when I get here, I'll make sure that I sew right through and then through the hat. And I'm going to put a bit of glue here and just lay that beard in. You could sew these if you wanted to. Like that. And I'm going to take my pom-pom and I'm going to glue it right there. I have some little stars. I'm going to put some glue on here. And I'm going to glue those on the hat. And I have this small leaf and berries. And I'm going to glue that over here.